the trickster. My goal is to help you create a calm and pleasing home that you and your family can enjoy for a lifetime. With my products and with my sharing of my tips and tricks, I'm here to help you get the organized home of your dreams. I have so many products that will help you not only achieve the beautiful aesthetic that you desire for your home, but I will show you how to use each of the products to create a system that will last you a lifetime. Hello and welcome to Get Neat with Lisa here at HSN. I'm your host, Natasha Lloyd. Thank you so much for shopping with me. Do you have that friend? Do you have that Lisa Trickstead friend, the one who you call and you're like, I have this huge product and I've just hit this wall and I don't even know where to start. And there's that one person who's somehow like a, a organizing genius, just a fairy godmother who came in to solve all those clutter problems. Lisa is that person, and not just that person here at HSN for us. She's that person all over the country, all over the world. It's what she does. She has a team today that's in someone's home doing full organization. And when she does this, she uses her own products to really make sure that where they organize stays organized. So we are going to get to show you those products, some of them that are actually brand new and have never before been seen on HSN. I wanna let you know, coming up a little bit later in the hour, my favorite pick of hers. It's our weekly deal drop. You're going to receive four of these. No, this is not open. It's actually a mesh, which I love. You can choose to display the mesh or not. It has these gorgeous leather handles. You can obviously, of course, open it from the top. You're getting four, not just two, you're getting four. You have a black, you have kind of a gray tone, a deep navy, and this one's my favorite. It's called the Sand Dollar. You're just gonna go online, check, check which color you want. Can I tell you a little secret though? Grab two packs, because eight is going to do 10 times more than four. I'm just telling you my experience, having done a lot of organizing myself for myself and my friends. Great deal on these. They're down to $39.95 for the week for all. Four. I love that mesh, Lisa. I'm seeing you over here. I love the mesh because you can see it, but it can still breathe. And boy, is it important for your fabrics to breathe when they're in a box like that. So smart. How come everyone doesn't do that? You ready for more smart tricks and hacks? Lisa Trigstead is here with us. She's here all the way today from, no, no, where are you from, Texas? I live in Dallas, Texas. Yes, ma'am. Do you really? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> no, 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 I think that we're supposed to have these turntables here, but maybe they're not here just they're, They're around here somewhere. You know they come, are. You want to come join me in my yes, coffee? Yes, ma'am. Let's so go. Lisa is here all the way from Texas today, but our first item is the Lazy Susan. And Lisa, let me tell you, first of all, to even put the word lazy in a sentence with you, <laughs> it's, it's, it's a sin. You know what I yes. mean? Yes. Well, but, a funny story. My brother-in-law calls them Lazy Lisas. <laughs> and I'm like, I like that so much better. They work for everything, right? <laughs> We are getting two of these, and look, I've, I've had Lazy Susans before where you put a little bit of weight in them, they start to wobble, and if it doesn't roll well, if it doesn't yes. rotate well, it's it's useless. So this is a ball bearing infused. I mean, you're talking about having the highest quality. They're really, really beautiful. You. And you can go into all of the um, ergonomics of the engineering yes. and how you created it. Yes. But I want you to know they are brand new here for us. We've taken $5 off that price of two, $14.95, $14.95 two pack and you're going to get them both home fridge pantry kitchen sink bathroom i mean oh, even next to the bedside it. table yes we use these literally in every space so i if i had to pick one organizing tool this would be it because they're so versatile i love using these in pantries if you have a corner it's the best place to put them in a pantry because things get lost in the back so when we go into clients homes we're looking for all that usable space so if you have stuff shoved in the back of your pantry that you cannot see this lazy lisa <laughs> is perfect for that. If you have an under sink problem that with all your beauty products that's hard to find, this is also great because you can't, it has a lip so that things aren't gonna tip off. And what Natasha was talking about is the base is very wide. Mm. Some Lazy Susans just have a small little turntable here and that that's what makes it tip. So I love that these are gonna stay nice and sturdy. You can use them in so many spaces, but under the bathroom sink, Yes. If you have, yes, and so the other thing about this is that if you have something up high, you want to be able to reach it, but you can't reach in the back of that cabinet, yes. so you can turn it. So you could put spices, all your cooking oils, the, the 
<laughs> Even cans. Yes. This is one thing that I didn't realize until moving into my home was there, there's not always uh, shelving space for the heavy items in yes. a safe location to your body. And I don't want to have to be reaching in or reaching high or reaching low for heavy items. But not all Lazy Susans, in fact, most of them cannot hold a certain amount of weight like several cans. These hold 15 pounds. Yes. That is significant. That is way beyond what you're normally going to find. 15 pounds each, plus you have that metal steel ball which is going to keep it rolling nice and smooth. Yes. The lip is great. Yes. It's a really nice, high quality, you know, you can see through it well. And I love the price, Lisa, because you could have oh. brought us something brand new and been like, look, it's the big investment piece, but no. you didn't. This is something where yes. people are gonna grab to know that they love your stuff and come back for more. Absolutely, and we had these in a collection a couple times ago, and these are backed by popular demand. Mm. And the price point is, you can't find that price point anywhere. And that the fact that they come in a set of two, which you never need just one. When I do <laughs> organizing, I am like, I want everything to be aesthetically pleasing. And so by having a balance of matching pro products just makes it feel so much better so the fact that you're getting two of these for that price is unheard of absolutely you know if it is a matter of how do I bring something closer to me that's wonderful too yes. but how about just keeping everything in one space that goes in that space in a nice and convenient way. Let me tell you, my bathroom sinks, not just underneath them, <laughs> even on top of them. My daughter's toys, her art supplies, oh, yes. anything that I'm using in the outdoor space where I just want to have, okay, the citronella candles, I want to have a little deck of cards for when my family yes. comes, some matches. I just want everything so everyone can reach in, everyone can, you know, reach what they want when they're, oh my gosh, I just realized you could use this for playing cards and the oh, person my goodness, can just yes, you sure <laughs> could. When I was growing up, we had one of these on our kitchen table, and oh, it had course. the salt and the pepper, and it had condiments, and it yeah. had the napkins. So this is just an up, up, a new uh, upscale version of that. And, and if there's one word, I'm so glad you mentioned this earlier, that I, in my mind defines Lisa. It, it, it really is aesthetic, yes. and you are you understand that aesthetically pleasing is important as well as the peace of mind of yes. being organized. And I have looked for Lazy Susans just to see if I could get a really, you know, can I just get one on a discount? This one's not going to be seen by other people people maybe it's gonna go in the back of this shelf I have had to say goodbye to ones because I'm telling you the wobble yes. that circle there that actually rotates it's too far in the center yes. of the actual lazy Susan a little bit weight off balance boom it doesn't twist it doesn't turn smoothly and now it's useless it doesn't hold 15 pounds it doesn't have that metal reinforced ball bearings it yes. doesn't it is not the quality that you get with someone who does this for a living yes. this is what you do yes ma'am we're in homes <laughs> every single day <laughs> and $14.95 this price will go up to $19.95 this is our price that we're bringing to you right now just as a welcome back after a few years of these not being here because right. let's face it a lot of things became so much more expensive to manufacture in the last few oh. years we don't want to bring it to you overpriced no. we brought it for you not just at the price but at the deal to say welcome back yes yes ma'am and like you said aesthetically pleasing is my buzzword because when things <laughs> are aesthetically pleasing and organized you and your the people that live in your home your family members are more apt to keep it that way because everything has a place to live so that's mm. the beauty of getting organized, is aesthetically pleasing, everything has a place to live, and it keeps your family organized. Now, if I did want to wash these, what's the best way for me to wash? Do not put these in the dishwasher, okay. just forewarn, just wipe them off with a damp cloth. Like, I have uh, oils and honeys on mine, and this is also the beauty of having these in your cabinet, is because if the honey drips or the oil on the bottle drips, it's going to go onto here versus your wood cabinet. So you could just take a warm, damp cloth and just wipe it clean. That's all you have to do. Can I tell you, too, just the look of the perfectly clear that you know the acrylic I paid too much money yeah. to order acrylic bars, just all acrylic bars, and that's what I have in my home for all of my window treatments. It's what I use for my coat hooks. I think there's nothing more beautiful and evergreen than just that clear cleanliness, and then whatever else you choose to do with any of your other decor can always adjust and never clash. It'll always look beautiful with this. You really put a lot of thought into these. They are a step above, and remember, you're getting two. I just heard from my producer that we have a lot of you on the line right now. We love for you to call in. That's wonderful, but if you haven't yet used our QR code. It's pretty simple. As long as you have a camera that has, I mean, <laughs> look at me. As long as you have a camera that's also a phone. As long as, isn't that true though, yes. honestly? As long as you have a phone that also has that camera, go ahead and open up the camera. Put it right there at the screen, your TV screen, where that black and white square is. And this little square and this little yellow line is going to pop up. Tap it. 
and guess what? It takes you right to the front of the line to check out. I hadn't used QR codes until I started here at HSN. Love that process. It's always the fastest and easiest yes, way to sure check is. out. Yes, ma'am. So the giving two of these. Yes. Most people don't come with two, and also the size is excellent. I know you might be wondering at home. They are almost 11 inches in diameter, high, a little more than 10 and a half inches. Yes. So that's going to fit even in what I have recently learned. The average is yes. a little over 11 inches for your china cabinets. Yes. They don't always reach those 12 inches. This is going to fit where maybe yes. some of the oversized Lazy Susans are not comfortably fitting. And that's the beauty of having an organizer design these, because I know that the standard depths of pantries and cabinets and uh, kitchen cabinet, the depth is usually 11 and a half to 12 inches right. deep. A pantry is usually 11 and a half to 12, sometimes 15 deep, but these are going to fit in every space, uh, definitely under a sink around all those pipes, yes. because you have to work around that under sinks. So, yes. yes. And I was you, so disappointed to learn that, and then you just said 11 and a half to 12. I'm yeah. like, I feel so proud of myself because <laughs> I, I just bought a, a buffet, a china cabinet yesterday. Oh, okay. Fun. Second hand, look, I'm doing my best. I have Yay. a young kid. Yes. But I realized all my 12 inch plates couldn't go in it. Oh. I needed something that was about 10 and a half, a yes. little between 10 and a half and 11. This is going to fit anywhere, even if you have an oversized Lazy Susan you haven't been able to use everywhere. Lisa thought of you. Yes, I know I a lot did. of you are buying more than one pack of two. I think that's very wise because this price will go back up again. But item number there is eight five three three nine six and remember you are getting the set of two well speaking of sets what's better than a set not of two four six eight ten twelve fourteen a set of sixteen that's right you heard me the get me spice jars storage set of sixteen now we say spice it doesn't have to be spices you can of course use them for your crafting supplies you can use them for your beauty supplies hair supplies come on. i think today we're just going through the home and showing all the ways yes, let's I dance. Like okay. setup. <laughs> so these are brand new which oh we love oh my gosh and, and look how cute look how yes. darling okay. I would hate to put these in a cupboard because they're too darn cute. So I have to pick it up and show you guys. So it yes. comes with this little easel that yes. you can put on a countertop, tabletop. I know yesterday I was watching in the hotel, all the crafters were here. This is perfectly set up for crafts. Oh, so good. Yes, but I had them designed for spices, which we'll show you the labels here in a few minutes. But you can hang this whole piece on the wall which if you have a pantry or you're lacking in space, this is also, it's so beautiful. And at home, I have my spices in it. And it's its so pretty. It comes with spice labels. It comes with expiration labels. I'll show you two, those over there in a second. But I love the versatility of this. You can hang it on the wall. You can set it up on the countertop. Or what's popular right now is you can lay it in a drawer and have a spice drawer. And you know what? Yeah. You know what I really love too is when you're organizing or cleaning and you go, you know, this thing would actually be a little better right over here. Well, you don't have to buy something new just because you now decided to put something else in this drawer or on that wall or on that countertop. This can work in all of those places and you can always say, I don't know, in six months I'll put it there and there. That doesn't happen with organizers. They're usually made just for the drawer or yes. just for the wall right. or just for displaying on a stand. Lisa has this ability for it to be a three and one really yes. and this to me the way that it is standing right now this is the one that is the most unique you very rarely find this when it comes to you know an organizer usually they have to stand completely straight or yes. on their back how darling is this when it's on its little easel and this really to me i look at this and i think i yeah I would be so upset putting this in a drawer. It is the cutest darn thing I've ever seen. You get all 16 jars. Now, are these silicone sealed? Yes, they are. And that's what I love is I always make sure that they're food grade sealed. So yes, mm. they have a gasket on there that keeps it airtight for all the spices. It's made out of glass, which you can put the glass part in the dishwasher, but the bamboo top, which bamboo is such a buzzword now, all the sustainability of bamboo, it can regrow fast. So I love that everything um, is made, the, the case and the lids are made of sustainable bamboo. They're beautiful. They match most any decor. And like I said, they Ugh. I have them for spice jars and they actually come with a set of spice labels. And then I have expiration date labels that you put on the bottom. So when you're decanting your spices, like we all do. Yes, because <laughs> you, you know, you have you buy the big ones, but then you want to have them just like this for cooking. You can 
put the expiration date on the bottom. And then you can use one of my Lazy Susans for the top of the cabinet to put all the backstock spices. So there you go. Okay, so in the perfect, <laughs> most incredible Instagrammed world, we have every single thing that Lisa has and our life is so much easier and more aesthetically pleasing. In my world, I'd be thrilled to have this for the hair, for the, you know, the bobby pins, those hair bands, all oh, the little knickknacks, yes. trinkets that I find, maybe one for the bathroom, one for the bedside table. But look at even how, and I think we're getting a close up here, perfect. Yes, ma'am. Look at even how we have these grooves because you can easily reach yes. in and pull out without knocking anything over. Right. They each have their own amount of space and see those grooves there that are etched into that bamboo. It really makes it so that there is no, there's no difficulty in the dexterity of removing whichever one you want. You don't have to move one out of the way no. to get to the other one. And this is what I've learned, Lisa. If yes. you have to do two steps, you won't do one exactly. step. Exactly. And that's the ease easy. of it. Yep. Yes. And you get the 16 jars. There's the possibilities are endless, but obviously I love them for spices, right? Of course, spices, crafts, beauty, you know, little, uh, if you're an artist, this is wonderful for little bits of, you know, I like to use a lot, a lot of gems. If anything oh, is, yes. if it's bedazzled, I want it. Yes. So this is gorgeous. Again, I want to show the back because I, I mean, really think you. it's a showstopper yeah. here to have this easel stand. Here we had a little bit of the packing there. Yes. The gorgeous on the back, again, you can mount it and you can keep it in a drawer. Yes. The dimensions on this are about 13 inches long, 11 and a quarter wide, and three and a quarter high. So yes. if you are wondering about fitting it in a drawer, if it's about 11 inches wide and yes. you have more than a three and a quarter of clearance, it should be just fine for any of your drawers. And it's just so gosh darn cute. Thank I mean, you. I love it too. And it does come with the mounting screws. Oh, so wonderful. you don't have to do anything. You, it just comes well, however you want to do it. It's ready to go. Food grade glass. And you're not yes. going to find glass. You don't find bamboo. Maybe you have like, you know, I have stuff that's like this that is just, I don't even care. You know, it, it, it's, it's, it's plastic. It's ugly and I'm not using it. I would want this displayed on my counter at all times. Yes. I love that you've thought of absolutely everything. Thank and it makes you. it easy 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 yes. to remove yes ma'am if you don't have an hsn credit card i'm just gonna let you know sign up for one you get ten dollars off your purchase today which we love that will bring this down to 39.95 but the best part about having an hsn credit card in my opinion is you get an extra flex pay on all of your items so for example this flex pay is going to be around 16 dollars and change on any credit card any of them you have an hsn credit card $12.49 this month, you get it home right away. You don't have to pay off the whole thing up front. It's just $12.49, you get it home. Next month, you do $12.49, then the next and the next, and then that's it. But you get it right away. And that's the beauty of the FlexPay and the HSN credit card, which gives you that extra month. Yes, it does. Speaking of some wonderful HSN deals and making your home beautiful and wonderful for spring, we have nearly natural plants here. They provide this high quality, lifelike faux trees and plants. They have a wide selection. It's sure to liven up your indoor or outdoor space. No matter what your style or your budget, check them out on hsn.com where you can actually find 25% off of select items. Just search nearly natural on hsn.com, which I did last night. I am in the market for a new fake plant. Oh, <laughs> good. <laughs> now it's time to move to the laundry and I'm gonna move over oh, here. Oh yes. The dreaded laundry, but nay, no more. Oh, look how much weight this Lazy Susan is holding. I know, oh. there you go. 15 pounds, if you didn't check these out, this is holding three of those laundry soaps. Imagine that to not yes. have to reach behind and get things, that's fantastic. So this laundry stand is brand new. And speaking of holding a significant amount of weight, it holds 70 pounds. Yes. If you're thinking, okay, I don't know, maybe it looks kind of, you know, like it's smaller, which I love that slim design. Let's face it, no one's laundry room is big enough. No one's, you know, home or storage areas are large enough. This is a really ergonomically sized piece. It's around 71 and a half inches high. You're looking at 12 inches deep. Yes. I actually love that because the depth is where is. you don't have the space for the walkway. Yes. But but with that, it holds 70 pounds, which we love. It's made with steel and bamboo. We're not talking plastic here. Nope. High quality materials. We love, we already have our hanging rack here, which of course, Lisa thinks of everything. <laughs> it is foam wrapped. It kind of has like this, almost like a gym mat material here yep. on the top. So your items aren't falling. They're not slipping over. It's just so smart. And I will tell you, I always say here, I love my Marla's. I call them, yes. I am now my Marla wins. Yes. I just was laying my Marla flat to dry. I was looking everywhere for something to hang it on. There you go. I, I never have the right amount of space to hang. This has everything involved and you've made it so well, Lisa. Thank you. And some laundry rooms don't come with a hanging bar. So that's why this yep. is really a neat little 
thing. And you can also hang it on the wall. So that's when I wanted to remember that. If you have little kids I like to climb, you can mount it to the wall for safety. I just wanted to mention that. Mm, thank so you. So you have two wire racks. You can put all your cleaning supplies down here. There's extra towels. This is one of my other products that we'll be talking about in a minute. You could put your dry cleaning in there. You have your steamer. And so I always like to show three different ways to use this. And if you don't have a drop zone. This is the perfect place to make a drop zone at the entrance of your home or at the back door. Drop zone. Number one, it's <laughs> so cute. It's cute to be sit sitting out. You can get little S hooks up here to hang the kids backpacks. You can put your bag, your purse right here. All the shoes can go right here or you could hang your coats up. The possibilities are endless. My sister has a pool house and she's gonna put one of these in her pool house. She also owns an Airbnb and this is perfect for extra closet space if you have an Airbnb and you don't have enough room for your guests. So there's three different ways that you can use it. I mean, my husband has an office that's not a closet. So you know, he doesn't have a closet because it is an office. Right. And there is nowhere to hang anything. This is perfect for something like that where if you have the room that doesn't have the closet space or it's not being used currently for hanging, toss this in that room because it's only going to go 12 inches off the wall. You're not building out. You're not adding drywall. You have this wonderful, I mean, it's almost two feet, exactly as two feet of, of closet space, which is, I think, what's required to even make a real closet yeah. anyway. Exactly. And then you have your shelves. If you want to use them for books, if you want to use them for shoes, did you call it a drop zone, Lisa? Yes, Now yes. tell me the importance of a drop okay, zone. Okay, so when we go into clients' homes, we always look for that space. And I always say to you, what are your pain points? And a lot of times people will say, the I don't have a drop zone. Or my front door turns into this just jumble of shoes and coats and backpacks. And so this is a perfect space to make a drop zone. And so that's what I love to do is to go into your home and find an area that can get organized and oh we always talk about using all that vertical space mm. because most everyone has blank walls that they can use this for if you don't have it in a laundry room you can do a drop zone like I said a pool house an Airbnb I even think this would be cute on my back porch it's covered so I think it would be really cute to have this as a plant stand so I, I can the possibilities are endless for me I can think of all the ways exactly and like you said steel bamboo it is beautiful I mean the shelf here is so pretty with that wood detail it's almost unfair to say it would go in the laundry room because it right. is gorgeous to have it you know displayed in your home in your entryway living room all of that and if you can listen to the Expert, and this is what she does. People pay her all over the world to organize their home. She says, here's what you gotta do. You gotta come home and work from the ground all the way up as much as you can because real estate is not just counters, my friend. It's not just counters or buckets on the ground like you may find in my home. We have more <laughs> space than that in our home and it starts from the ground up. You have shelf one, shelf two, and really shelf three here. Yes. Plus you have two full feet of hanging, which I love that you reinforced it with this, this foam. The this, rubber grip. Yes, yes, rubber grip. That's the right That's word. That's the word. And this is going to make it so things aren't slipping and sliding. Yeah. It also just gives it that nicer, higher-end feel. It does. And wait, imagining the S-hooks, like you said, putting the bags on it, because 70 pounds. Oh, 70 yes. pounds is a great amount of weight, but it weighs 17 pounds. So this is something where it's easy to pick up, move around, but it is sturdy, made well, and look, toss a Lazy Susan on exactly. it, make your life even easier. <laughs> yes. Yeah, all these are my products. These are from, uh, we're going to talk about these a little bit, but all, this is all my product. And one thing that I love about when I organize, or design these organizational pieces is I have what about four maybe six lines that I've already done all of the pieces are inner changeable and they all mix and match they mm. all flow so if you've bought some previous products in my lines it's gonna go with this my new line as well so that's the beauty of me designing it from the get-go like a few years ago is when I started to now is everything is cohesive again I'm going for that aesthetically pleasing home it and that is gonna that's what's gonna help you want to stay organized when things have a place to live whether mm. if you find them aesthetically pleasing and then every Everyone in the family knows where to put things away. I love that. Your home will be cleaner if you know where something goes. That's absolutely true. A little under $20, $19.99 will get this home to you on Flex. That's four Flex pays for this, which I love. So for a $20 bill, you're going to get this home right away. Put it by the door. Put it in the laundry room. Put it in that place where right now you go, uh-oh, it's a problem zone. And just watch, watch how much easier life is when your brain doesn't have to think about what to do and where to place something. It is just the drop 
zone. Of course, adding in any of your other products is excellent. I love how well they your storage match. boxes fit yes. with this. Beautiful, beautiful. But this is your option here for the hanging, for the multiple shelves, and for it made with steel and bamboo. Home for $19.99. Great price, Lisa. Thank we have you. a whole hour of Lisa here. And what I love, <laughs> I'm going to be asking her more of these questions because I don't want to just learn her products. I want to learn her secrets. Yes. So stay with us for the hour, and you're going to get all of those secrets along with me. But in the meantime, if you don't have our streaming service, just want you to know it's totally free. It's completely free. There are other streaming services you might be subscribed to. You're paying monthly fees. I don't like it. You don't like it. I'm always debating canceling them. This one is free. You just check it out. It's HSN Plus. That's plus.hsn.com, P-L-U-S.hsn.com, or you can find it wherever you find your other streaming services. And you can download it and watch our shows, watch other extras. Sometimes there's movies. Sometimes there's cool interviews and concerts. And it's free. Did I mention it's free? That's I awesome. love that. <laughs> We're going to take a quick break. When we come back, we'll have more tips, tricks, and awesome new products from our resident neat organizing expert. Thank you. <laughs> My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. It's Customer Appreciation Month, and it's all about you. For the entire month of April, we're showing the love to our HSN Card VIPs with exclusive perks like VIP Thursdays. Get a special offer every Thursday in April, plus extra flex on every item under $369 all day every day, or VIP financing on so many items. Not a card member? Apply now and instantly get $10 off when you're approved. Visit hsn.com slash hsncard or call 1-800-695-1418 for details on our exclusive VIP offers. Thank you for being an HSN Card. VIP. I created Nakery Beauty to address your biggest beauty concerns. At Nakery, we work with scientists to create highly effective products using powerful ingredients that work together to target your specific needs. This is skincare for your whole body, and we're proud to be considered an HSN clean beauty brand. Inspired by women like you, Nakery is dedicated to providing cutting-edge innovations so you can feel beautiful all over. Welcome back to HSN. I am your host, Natasha Lloyd. Thank you so much for shopping with me and for getting neat and tidy and organized with me. If you haven't yet seen our host closet, it's a whole new thing that we're trying. It's on hsn.com. You just search host closet and you can actually see all of the items that we're wearing in our shows. I know we get a lot of comments online sometimes like, I love the storage bins, but what about that dress? So if you love my dress or anything else that we're wearing on air, just search host closet and you can check it out. I'm wearing a DG2 stretch denim dress and when they say stretch, they do mean stretch. I mean, look at that. You would think that this is kind of like one of those stiff, you know, maybe a rigid denim. It's not. It really feels just like a nice, still substantial, still has a nice weight to it, but really, really surprising at the stretch and the movability on it. It does include the tie. The buttons are functional. You can button all the way down or up. And when I tell you, these pockets are not joking around. I mean, we got some real genuine pockets, really, really versatile spring, summer. You could even pair this with a cute knee-high boot for fall. Um, I'm impressed, I'll be honest, I'm impressed with it. So you can check that out on the host closet on hsn.com. Now, if there is items that you love, but you only wear them seasonally, or maybe you're like me and you absolutely refuse to ever get rid of any of your baby's clothes, <laughs> <laughs> This is where my storage box is going. You know, I actually use storage boxes for my um, for my hair curlers. I use them for, obviously, my, my daughter. I use them for my dog stuff. I use them for my scarves. There is never a shortage of things that you would need to put in some kind of storage box because you don't need it right at the ready for you to reach for it, but you need it somewhat at the ready. And I know Lisa's probably able to explain the psychology of that better. All I know is I want them, I need them, and I can never have enough. Now, yes. Lisa is giving us a 
set of four. These are usually $49.95, but just for this week only, the price is gonna go up again at the end of the week, back to that price. For this week, it is $39.95 for all four. You do get to choose your color and you will be getting four of that color. You're seeing my favorite color here. We're calling this the sand dollar. And over here on my little foot, what are these called? Oh, the footstool, the, the end footstool, of the bed. The, end bed. <laughs> <laughs> the, the bench, on my bench, we have the navy, the black, and the alloy. The alloy is that pretty neutral gray color. Now, the handles on these are a step above, but yes. the real piece de resistance is yes. the mesh. You do not find this on most storage bins, and it not only gives you the visibility, it gives the breathability, and that's so important for keeping items when you are storing them, whether it's taking them out every day or even just you know, once a year. Absolutely, and I love them because if normally you need to have a label because you don't know what's in here, but now if you have these stacked up on your closet shelf, like you mentioned, for all your back stock clothing, all of your you know seasonal gear, or like you said, a memory box for all your kiddos, you don't have to worry about what's in it because you can turn it sideways and be able to see exactly what's in it. But they have a lid, so if you turn them this way, you can stack them. And so what I want you to do is measure from the shelf in your closet to the ceiling. That that is how much vertical space that you have to put these bins. And then, like I said, you can turn them sideways to look and see what's inside. Because they have a lid, you can stack them nice and neat. Again, they come in a set of four because when I'm coming into your space and organizing, I want all the bins to be matching. It creates, a, a, the, the visual clutter goes away mm. when all the bins are matching. And so that's one of the reasons why we want to sell these as a set of four because you don't just need one when you're doing your closet, when you're doing your coat closet, when you're doing your kiddos closets, you're gonna always need more than one. You wanna fill up that shelf in the closet and then again, go all that vertical space. There's so much room in these. They're like 12 by 12 by eight. And so they, they will stack to the ceiling if you need them to. And they can stack as well because the tops are rigid. I yes. mean, you do have a nice hard top, so it's fine to be stacking them. Yes. And the, the weight capacity is pretty impressive too, 15 pounds yeah. per bin. So if you choose to be using that vertical space, as Lisa said, this is going to be your option beyond, I mean, I spent way too long in my life using bins that didn't have tops, Lisa. I know, because you're Why missing do that all <laughs> of that vertical space and that's the beauty of hiring an organizer you guys are hiring me through here because you get all my tips and tricks here on hsn when i design these things for you so that's what i'm here for i'm here to answer all your questions and tips and tricks and design products that are going to be aesthetically pleasing but yes. are going to last so yes. that's another thing that's important to me is when you get organized i want those these products to last for you because you you, you don't just need to be organized for a week or a month you want to be organized for the rest of your life mm. so that's what i'm here for to help you guys get organized. They come in four colors, which again, I mentioned earlier, all of my pieces, even if you bought pieces from the last few collections, they're all gonna coordinate. I think it's so obvious when you say it out loud, but it really hadn't occurred to me that the importance of having your storage bins match is pivotal to the space itself not looking cluttered. And I don't want that to um, get, you know, stress anyone out at home who goes, I just finally put stuff in a bin. Now you're saying the bins have to match? I get that because I hadn't really thought about it, but when you're getting four, you don't have to question it. Now you can grab two. I will tell you eight is gonna fix whatever wall, whatever space 100%. you're looking for. I would recommend yes. doing the two because at the end of the week, those two are gonna cost $20 more to grab two sets. But if you do just wanna grab the one set, grab the color you love. Sand Dollar is definitely our most popular right now, but we still have a little less than 1,000 total to go around. So grab the Sand Dollar if you love it. Remember, you're getting all four of the ones you're seeing here. You can display it with the mesh racing forward. I love that. Yes. You can, of course, if you want. Now, Lisa, would you recommend for when uh, we're displaying them, what's the most aesthetically pleasing way to display these? Box. So for me, I'm going to turn the mesh to the side because I want this leather handle to show. Mm. And, and that way, if it's up on a shelf, you can pull the handle towards you and get it off the shelf that way. But the, the cool thing is, is that you can just turn it sideways and see exactly what's in there. So um, that's why I did the handle so that you could see it. When I go into clients' homes, they're number one. I, I, can, I already know what the problem is when I walk in there, but I want to <laughs> help them. And so I ask them, 
how does this space make you feel? And they're like, I feel overwhelmed, I feel stressed out, I feel cluttered. And that's because there's too much visual clutter. And what I mean by visual clutter are things are just shoved on a shelf, shoved on the closet. And by adding storage bins that are all matching, that hold all of your things, they keep them nice and neat, so that in the next season, they're still gonna be fresh and clean to wear for the next season. This is what's gonna help you get rid of all of that visual clutter, because that's what messes up our brains. It makes us have anxiety. Uh, I feel like you just entered into my life. <laughs> and and you, you understand exactly where my mind is. And, and I happen to be, just so you know, I'm the Lisa in my friend group. Oh, good. Okay, but I am like your Padawan. I'm the one who's learning from my Obi-Wan, if you know my references. So basically, like, I feel like you know exactly everything, and I'm sitting here like, teach me your ways, even though this is my <laughs> ultimate goal in life, to become you. I, I love that you're giving us the four. I love that you made these tops hard, that we can hold, you know, 17 pounds with each of them. If you are not using vertical space, there is a reason you feel stressed or cluttered. You can stack these on top of each other, even if all you have is a 12 inch space between one piece of furniture and the next. Yes. Putting these four all lined up next to each other could be the answer to all of the shoes, all of the scarves, sweaters. all of the art projects, all mm -hmm. of the sweaters if it's in your closet. And I know that you know the breathability to me is important, uh, it, especially if maybe you're somewhere where it's more humid or yes. something like that. You don't get that a lot with these, but if you look at any of the boxes around your home, what are you currently using to throw stuff in because I, I know you would say nightly, nicely put away and organize but for me it's throw. <laughs> what are you using to throw stuff in does it have a lid is that lid hard do you have at least four of them that all coordinate does it breathe so that those items are not going to get musty and, and mothbally is it something where when you look at it your space looks nicer yes. if you answered yes to all of those then you can wait on this product and, and go for the next one but if you didn't this is your chance to grab four of them at a price that will go up at the end of the week lisa which one's your favorite color uh, well i am like you i love the sand dollar one because that's the color scheme of my house and so these but i give you four different choices so that whatever aesthetic is in your home currently you can pick a color that's going to coordinate with what you already have so i actually think and is it okay if we walk to the black yes, let's too. Because I think the black is really, really elegant, and I want to give it its moment. Yes. Because whether or not the... Now let me see. What's my best way? I don't want to just throw myself on this bed here. <laughs> let's, uh, <laughs> let's take a little yes, siesta. Shall we? Yeah. I think the black is really elegant. It is a true black. It's not a faded black. Right. So if you are purchasing for you know yourself, your office, something like that, I think the black is going to be evergreen, as will the sand dollar. The blue, to me, is wonderful for an office space. Oh, yeah, or a little kiddos room, Ooh, a, boys room. a play oh, yes. room, yes, play I, room. I love this color of blue. And all of these are primary colors. I feel like, and they're all neutral. They say, like a photographer will say, blue is the most neutral color because it looks good on everyone. Same in your home. If you have something blue, it just kind of acts as a neutral. Oh, I love that. Mm -hmm. I hadn't even thought about these for organizing toys. And especially if you have any kind of organizer shelf already that needs a certain measurement of mm -hmm. the items to put into it, Lisa, as always, wants to make sure everything fits where it's supposed to fit. So the 12 by 12 is wonderful, but sometimes the actual clearance space of the 12 inches wide is shorter than 12 inches on a lot of these shelving units. It's eight and a half inches high. This is so wonderful, and I don't know if you've ever experienced this at home, where you get the box and you go home and you try to put it in and it's a little bit too high for that shelf or that cubby. This is going to fit with also a little bit of clearance usually yes. in the cubby, and that's important too, That is it? important, but I also, a pro tip is measure, 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 <laughs> because I want you to be happy when you get this home. And so all the, the statistics are on the website. But like I said earlier, I have done all the research and I'm in homes every day. So I know the standard depths of a shelf. And so this is gonna fit on most closets, most coat closets. If you have a little cubby for the kids play area, this will fit on top of that or stack. I used to be a school teacher. I taught preschool for a while too. No wonder. Yeah, so the kids <laughs> can put things away. I love teaching kids to get organized as well, but this helps them too because they can see what's in here. So like with like, 
is another buzzword in the organizing world. So like with like, they can see what's in here. Like I said, the possibilities are endless. When you say, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna circle back to the like <laughs> with like, but I do wanna know, uh, how do these collapse and do they collapse if I just for whatever reason Absolutely. move them or wanna store them? Absolutely, if you need to them? store them, they come apart. So this little insert is what keeps it square. Okay. Look how nice and neat. Mm. And it stores just like this. If you're moving, or if you need to pack it up to go, or if you want to change spaces, or your kids grow out of things and you're like, okay, yep. I'm gonna send this to the college dorm with them. It look how nice and flat it packs. And this is how it will come to you. And uh, it, it's so easy to put together. Yeah, I bet look. I can count to 10 and it'll I be done. I can do this Two, in five seconds. Three, yes. four, less than 10 seconds. There. Uh, <laughs> Now, sand dollar is moving quickly, so if you do love that sand dollar or the alloy, which right now is in second place, I highly invite you yes. to not just put it in your cart, but to check out because someone else can grab it if you don't grab it, even if it's already in your chart, which is so sad. Okay, I do want to quickly ask before we move to the shoe rack, yes. what do you mean by like with like? Okay, so when you're organizing, I want yes. you to go into the space, and I want you to pull everything out of that space, and <gasps> then I want you to sort it into categories that like are shoes. like. shoes? With like shoes, <laughs> scarves, gloves, all of those things. Because that's how you're gonna know where everything in your house is. Because if you think in your brain, okay, where are all the winter gloves? Well, they're all in one place in the house. They're gonna be in that those bins on top of the coat closet. I can turn it sideways. There's the gloves, there's the hats, there's the scarves, and we are set for winter because I have it all like with like. Like with <laughs> like, I love it. Okay, so shoes are a massive storage problem. We know that. Yes. I've seen something before where it's about one third of this. When you talk about vertical space being the answer yes. to someone not needing a larger home but having more storage, this is really personifying that maybe as, as well as anything that you create. This is your over the door shoe rack. It yes. is 12 tiers. Yes. And right now we're looking at 50% off, 24.95. Wow. We have white and gray available. The white, however, only has, I think, a around 200 left total. So if you love the white, grab it now. And I think a lot of people like white because it matches their doors and it blends yes. in nicely with that. Um, so Lisa, I wanna know, it comes home, you put it together like a normal shoe rack, but these three all attach together? They all attach together. And if you don't want to hang it over a door, you can actually attach it to the wall. My sister-in-law uses it in her garage right as she walks into their back door and they don't wear their shoes in the house. So she ha actually has it attached to the wall right next to the garage so they can take off their shoes and put them away. But the other cool thing about this is because it comes in three sections and you can see, I don't know if the camera can get up close, you can nail it, screw it into the wall. And if you have little kids, you can put the three side by side along the ground of the, you know, the bottom half of the wall in the garage or in the mudroom and the kiddos can put their shoes away and it's down low for them. So it's versatile for so many ways. I actually do see the little holes here yes. that you could use. Now, you may not want to nail it into your door, but if you are just going to put one of those little, the, you know, the, the little tiny nails right there on the wall, that's going to give you all of that mm -hmm. extra, you know, sturdiness and durability of this. Yeah. And, and I would just say, you know, look, I read all the reviews. I think people are opening and closing doors quite a bit. And I know that sometimes you throw your shoes on something and you're not necessarily being as cautious as possible. And that's just life. That's who we are. Yes. So I would recommend if you think that maybe you have the kids running around and it's going to you know, have a lot of wear and tear on it. Maybe do Lisa's idea, put it in the closet and just use those extra two little guide nails. Yes. And now you have a built-in shoe rack yes. in your closet Across and you've got bottom. it for less than 25 bucks. Yes. It's and they're so, it's so easy to put together. You, I just put it together and I use my little rubber mallet and I make sure that these are really tight in there. Ooh, that's important. And okay. it comes with two different hooks. I want to mention that. Two different hooks, so if you have a standard door or if you have a solid wood door, you're gonna get the hooks that are gonna fit both sizes of doors. Or, like I mentioned, you can hang it directly onto the wall. It comes with that hardware as well. Or, the third way is to use it, separate the pieces, put them on the, the lower half of the closet, right? You can just use those little drywall screws and put those right into the drywall. They're super tiny, but then that way the kiddos will have a spot to go and put their shoes away by themselves and 
helping them become independent, teaching them to be organized that are life skills that'll last them forever. So I've been carrying shoe racks with me that are just like this um, from home to home to home. Mm -hmm. And mine are not at all the full wall. It's just one third of this. And I have literally kept it with me. I know we just put it together, but what I do, the mallet is so important. And yes. I'll say this, because this is what I've noticed yes. when I take it from home to home. If this is done with no tools and you're just literally putting the bar together and then you're putting your shoe on it, that's gonna be something where if it doesn't have that really good connection where yes. you've actually, it doesn't need to be a hammer, but you know, oh, a, a rubber mallet. Yes. Sometimes you use the, the bottom of a, one of the shoes that you're that, about to put into. <laughs> <laughs> if, if, if you don't do that, yes, sometimes these can, you know, kind of spread apart over time just from moving. And that happens with all shoe racks it that does. are this design. That's just normal. Yes. So I really want to encourage you when you get it to use that, that little rubber mallet or the bottom of your shoe you're going to use and make sure that it's nice and really secured in there because that's the difference between, you know, this never having to be, oh, touched up or not. But yeah. heaven forbid you do have to touch one up. Look, I've been literally using the same one for six years. I wish I had something that's convenient because vertical space is brilliant, It Lisa. is. And that's what I always do. When I go into clients' homes, that's what I'm looking for. We all have doors, right? We all have a door, whether it's going from the garage into the door. We have closet doors. We have laundry room doors. So the bedroom closet doors. So this, like, again, is so versatile because you're going vertical. If you decide to use it straight up and down, how that's how it's designed, then you're going to use all of that vertical space. And the other goal of getting organized is to get things up off the floor, mm. get rid of that visual clutter. If you go into your closet and your shoes are just all over the closet floor, you're down on your hands and knees and you're, you're shuffling underneath the clothes, I promise, because I am in clients' homes every day. That's what it happens. And so this is going to help you see what you have, know where to find it, and be able to use it. And also prolongs the life of your shoes. I mean, oh, we yeah. spend, uh, I mean, I know I do. I love shoes. And so I buy all the cute shoes. I want them to last longer. And this is going to help you do that. Also, not all shoe racks accommodate all different kinds of shoes. Um, I know that the ones that my husband used, I can't put my heels in them. And right. then sometimes they're too narrow, you know? Yes. And so you need to have something higher if you have the heels. Or maybe they're only really great for heels. I actually saw in the video on that B-roll that we just had, it was so interesting because some of them, you had the, the shoes going in vertically. Yes. Some of them you could put them angled down. You, you can sure see can. down here we have, you know, boots that are fitting here. The, the really tall boots here at the top. Yes. So this isn't just the ones that are going to fit the sneakers, but they're right. not tall enough for the heels. Or maybe, you know, I've had some before where they're all supposed to be just kind of standing straight up and down, but those heels, they slide through the bars. Yes. And then they all kind of get all kerfuffled. Yes. So this is really wonderful where the shoes themselves are not touching each other, and it will work for any type of shoe that you have. Yeah, so here we have the tall booty, which we all have. They're so cute, but then we are able to put them in this way and there's a bar going either direction so it's going to hold them in place and it works for women's sizes and men's sizes as well so you could get one for you and one for your hubby and whoever you share a closet with you you can each have one for your shoes um, and the other thing too is if you have a kids that share a closet, you could have several of the kids have their shoes on here and you would have plenty of room for that. And for $12 and 48 cents, is that what, what it is to get it home? Crazy. To get it home on Flex, yes, $12 and 48 cents, which really, I mean, if you even break that down into the three different that you have, you're looking at a little over $4 for each of those shoe racks. Now, how many shoes can we fit on this? If it's 12 tiers, with how many shoes on each tier? 12 times two? three is 36, 36. pairs of shoes. <laughs> I love that. So for my shoe drop zone, now that I'm learning the turn drop zone. There you go. Wonderful. Okay, so if, now again, I love the idea of the extra durability of it using those nails. I Personally, that's what I want to do. I don't want to ever question, you know, if I ever need to look at something again or, or do that. So the nails, I could use that right on the inside wall of my closet. Yes. Maybe it's right on the wall before I enter the home, by the garage. Maybe it's mm -hmm. even in there in the laundry room, yes. but I've actually never seen a shoe rack before that allowed you to use those tiny little, do they call them like guide nails or something? You know, the ones that are the really small ones, it's just enough so that you could put this against a wall, don't even worry about it being on the door if you don't want, and it will stay there, but then when you take it out, it's not some big honking right. screw holes or anything like that in the wall. It's almost invisible, you know? And if you're gonna go use a vertical on a wall, it comes with the hardware you need. So it comes with a little drywall anchor is what it's called, 
and then a screw. And so a drywall anchor is super easy to fix if you need to move it. Hopefully you don't need to, but no matter how you use it, it's gonna come with the hardware that you need. Wow, 36 pairs of shoes. That's like a third of what I own. There you go. No. You need three of them then. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> I've actually done a very good job editing down my good. shoes over time, especially since starting here because we get such great deals on shoes. And what I realized is, A, I don't wear them if I don't see them. So it's great to have something visible like this so I can see the shoes that I want to wear and then be able to actually choose to wear them. That's important. They're not, you know, way there in the back of my closet or like you said, buried beneath other piles. But I also realized that maybe there's not going to be more than 36 pairs that are born between my husband and I. So if this is the only space I need to store the shoes, what a wonderful way to have that done. And then now I have all that floor space. No in my closet or wherever else I was keeping them available to me. You said something earlier, Lisa, though, about that that kind of struck me. You said you get you want to get things up off the floor. Yes. Is that like a thing in organizing? Oh, it totally is a thing. Really? So if, if we're in your home and you, you've had us come and want us to help you with your closet, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get in there and we're going to pull all the stuff that's on the floor. We're going to pull all the stuff that's on the shelf and we're going to bring it out because Number one, you probably didn't know it was there because it's on the floor, it's hanging under your clothes, or it's shoved under your clothes, and if you have a shelf, your clothes are covering it. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get all of your stuff out, we're gonna sort it like with like, just what I was saying earlier, put it into like with like zones, and then we're gonna put it back systematically in a way that you know exactly what you have and where to find it, and in bins, and we're gonna label it, and we're gonna get you a shoe rack, and we're gonna do all the things to help you. And that's the beauty of having me here at HSN is because I'm gonna teach you guys all my tips and tricks right here. Ah, I love it. Oh, we have a really, really good product coming up next. Actually, I'm surprised we didn't promo it. But before that, I just need to like whisper something to you okay. that we didn't have time for. There are rope baskets that Lisa sells. They are two packs. Yes. They have 10 inch option. And I believe there's even a larger option as well. But there look, are. they are on clearance right now. And you are getting two for $39.95 or two for $49.95, depending on which inches you want to get. Now, I want to invite you, 10 or 12 inches, I want to invite you to try to find something made this well that is these rope baskets for a two pack for this price. I have tried, they are so trendy. Even at the most discounted anywhere I could try yes. to find online, I wanted them for my daughter's room. I thought, my gosh, these, these things are just so, in my opinion, out of reach, unaffordable. And now I see two yes. for a pack that is excellent. You just gotta choose your color, okay? We have black or cream, they're both gorgeous. We are not able to give you a full presentation, but if you've always loved that aesthetic and you've loved that look, I'm telling you, that is a good price for those baskets, it is. Lisa. And it actually really is. And they coordinate with the other, the other bins, so you can have that mm. uh, cohesive look. Those are so trendy and so beautiful. Yes. Okay. I, I just want to put someone on blast right now, and I and I don't know if, if I'm allowed to say this or not as a as a salesperson, but I, I want to say something. I read every review of the things that I that I am selling, and um, I saw two reviews that said something in terms of why they didn't absolutely love this product, and I just have to say it. They said it was too much storage space. Ah! They said, they said the trays were just a little bit too big, and I thought that's fine, absolutely for their home, that's fine, I get it, but. Me, if I'm reading that review, it's making me rush to buy the thing. Because absolutely. <laughs> I, I absolutely, and that's totally fine, of course. You may have seen things that look like this that are on a smaller scale, so maybe someone could expect that. Totally fine. We have great exchanges and, and you know, return processes here. That's fine. But I just wanted to say, if you want something that you look at and go, oh, this is a little bit more substantial than I expected. There's a little bit more storage here than I expected. Yes. Look no further. Now, with that being said, half off what? clearance price <laughs> originally 94.95 now 39 is it 39 yes 39.95 is that correct wow. or is it 49 i have to go. excuse okay 49.95 yeah so we're looking at half off it's like 48 percent off you're just going to choose the black or the white each of them have that gold finish yes. they have a three-tier system that has the perforated bottom so it does have that breathability you know you can use it you know in a bathroom area wherever you may like for the babies i love that too for yes. your bedroom next to your beds it doesn't matter but let me let me tell you, when I saw that complaint that said, you know what, a little too much storage, oh. I thought, I can't wait to see those. And I look at them and I thought, wow, unique, Lisa. I can't believe these are on clearance for half off. I know. Please, so I don't. 
don't sleep on don't this deal. Don't wait. I have this black yes. one. And I, you know, I love this. And when I designed it, I love the height because you can use it as a nightstand in your bedroom. You can Absolutely. use it as a little, um, you know, bar cart if you want. Because it, it's so cute. I love to do seasonal things. I love to sh throw showers at my house, baby showers, bridal showers. That, this makes a great gift for both moms and brides because they can use it in their home. So it fits perfectly at the end of a couch, in between two chairs. If you have a little space in between your washer and dryer, this is a really way pretty way to elevate that space and put some laundry things in there. But yes. I love how they have it designed over here. They show, they're showing you guys three different ways to style it. This is for a bathroom. Yep. So create your own spa in your bathroom. This is set up for a baby's room. How many times uh, uh, us as moms, when we were nursing our babies or rocking our babies at night, we needed something just to be able to grab and with one hand and reach. This is perfect for a nursery. And then on the bottom, again, it's craft, it was craft day yesterday. This is a beautiful way to put all of your crafts or projects that you're still working on. You can set them right here without having to put them away. So again, there's so many ways they are versatile. I love that they come in white or black. The, the shelves are perforated so things will breathe. Super easy to put together. It comes with an Allen wrench so you can put it together yourself. I use it for, I use mine mostly for entertaining, and then when I'm not entertaining, it's in my office in between my two chairs. So. Okay, so hold on one second. I need to confirm on Kay. something. Now, it does say it comes with wheels. We didn't put wheels on these. Does this have wheels? There's another one that has wheels. Oh, this so, one didn't have the wheels. Okay, okay. There's two of them. So if you go to the website and looking for this, they're both listed on the website. One has wheels, one does not. Got it, got it. Okay, so, they, but it is made with the metal it is metal yes. and now I, I do want to give you the actual dimensions of this okay. okay so if you're at home and you're looking you're like oh i love the size of it what actually is it these are the actual dimensions you're looking at 21 inches long okay so that's how long these trays are and then the depth of the trays is about 11 and three quarters inches so if you look at your hands right now and you do a 21 inches by 11 and three quarters you're going to see in front of you it's almost like a serving tray it that's is that's about the size that you would use that you would then you know place on a table or something you're yes. getting really three of those large serving trays, whereas a lot of times the bar carts or, you know, the end table carts, there may be half that amount of, of size of storage. Three of those serving trays, the full height is 32 and a half inches high, but remember, of course, that's including this handle. If you put weight on these shelves. We're talking about, I mean, I know I have a certain amount of weight capacity here that's showing me what it is, but I think that might be included if you are adding wheels. But you're saying you could put weight on these shelves like for even bottles of something, like oh, a bar cart, yes. you said? How pretty this would be for a bar cart Gorgeous. Setup. Even if like we have a back patio and right now in Texas, it's perfect weather. Same here in Florida, it's perfect weather to be outside. This is really cute on your outdoor patio as well. So you could set up your little plates and napkins and cups, a little drink station for outside by the patio. Like I said, it's the perfect height to go at the end of a couch for a nightstand. Um, it fits most spaces. If you have a small apartment, you can put it lengthwise, you know, vertically or, or horizontally, however way it fits. Mm. I love it between my two chairs and my office. That's it. There's right there. You have a style with different office supplies. Again, the, the it's so versatile that the, the it is. It's it is. Yeah, endless ideas. And uh, the wheels one, we do have this one available. It is $59.95, and we're going to be selling that at 1 p.m. So if you did love the idea of adding the wheels onto it, there's that visual there. It's a little bit different where the handles are on the sides instead of slimmer. the one over the top here. Yeah. And it's a little bit uh, slimmer. If you do search this item number, though, both of these uh, will be available for you to choose. So make sure you're choosing the one that you want. The one that has the larger trays, which is my personal favorite, is the one you're seeing right now with yes. us. And this is the one that is $39.95, which really is, I mean, about as close to half off as you can get. From $94.95, our flex pays are less than $20 to get it home. I mean, it weighs nine pounds. This is something that is so convenient, so substantial. Of course, I love it next to a bed. I think that's excellent. Yes. Uh, but I also was even thinking for a plant cart because yes. it's, it has those perforated edges. If by chance, you know, the water has 
has to go somewhere. It's yes, not pooling. It goes right through. It's such a great idea yes. if you are someone who likes to display your plants, your yes. succulents, and maybe you want to have something else on a tray beneath it. Maybe a couple books on top, plants in the center. The, uh, the opportunities are endless here, but what she's really done is given you extensive storage real estate that is really like a serving tray that is perforated if you wanted to use something that might need that extra breathability or that drop down and you're getting three of them. Because yeah. as Lisa is teaching us, it's not about leaving it all on the ground or just having <laughs> one thing. It's about the ability to vertically build that real estate in your home. And this is really giving you three serving trays worth of storage all right here home for 48% off, which I, I absolutely I love. I can't believe that either. Yes, now how high are these edges here? Just in case people are wondering. They're about three about inches. About three inches. It's about it a three a inch lift. lift. So you really can, I mean, even more than a serving tray because you can push things up against the edge. It would yes. hold books up, you know what oh, I mean? absolutely. Like, yeah. So I, like, I'm just sitting here thinking, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna take mine outside because like I said, we're entertaining a lot outside right now. And I can have the drink set up here, but I could also have beach towels for the pool and whatever magazines to read or a citronella candle there I'm just thinking of all the possibilities so I always love that the, my pieces are versatile you can take them inside or outside on the back patio if it's covered in office in a kitchen for entertaining a, a nightstands if you have an apartment and you don't want I mean now if you don't want to spend very much for a nightstand here you go you can get two of them yes. for the price of one yes. that's crazy yes or, or if you're someone who just says I wish I had a little bit more storage on the cart that I'm currently using. This is gonna be your answer. It's not just two, it's three of these full shelves. Again, the measurements are around 21 inches by about 11 and three quarters. So, I mean, a real like serving tray with the lips uh, on the edges, three of them. The complaint, too much storage. Oh. <laughs> If you love it, send me the note that you love it. <laughs> Lisa, I am so happy to have spent this time with you. It was fun. You're wonderful. Congratulations on being a Nana. I saw oh, your bracelet. thank you. Yes, Guess my favorite name. Oh, wonderful, <laughs> Nana. We'll see you soon. And coming up, we have Concierge Collection. I'm staying with you for the next hour. I am so thrilled. Let's get comfy and let's keep our new organized home beautiful. <laughs> Hello? Hey, hunky husband. I am. I'm using the cart that you got me from Storesmith. I'm actually using it for all of our laundry 